C.J. Brea doesn't get on the field as much as he wants. It's hard to get a spot sometimes. But he's learned to accept that role at Kennedy, thanks to his coach, Tim Lewis. He instilled the fight, never give up. And, I mean, from the 0-5 start last year to coming out here and uh, winning most of our games, um, he, he's instilled that in us. And Brea is one of many Cougars who echo that respect. He's a great person. He knows how to t coach. He knows how to teach and he knows just how to do stuff right. People want to stick their neck out for him because he'll do the same for you and everybody knows that. I've been with him for four years and I wouldn't want to be with any other coach. I've become the man that I um, am becoming because of Coach Lewis. Um, he, he's the dad at school. And like any parent, he wants to see his kids succeed in life. When people say, well, you got a great football team, and I don't really know that until about 10 years from now. Um, what are they going to turn into? Are they going to, what kind of dads are they going to be? What kind of citizens are they going to be? What kind of employers or employees are they going to be? And that's what's so rewarding for Lewis. He does know because his former players let him know. They send him thank you letters. And over the years, he's accumulated hundreds. Those letters that come back and, and thank you for the things that you've done and the impact you actually had, uh, I, I go to those a lot just to, to remind myself why I do this. A tradition CJ plans on honoring. I'll definitely, definitely make sure uh, that my kids know about what Coach Lewis does and um, make sure that I keep in touch with him. In Cedar Rapids, Landon Stoller. One, two, three, CBS Two Sports.